oh hi welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to tell you everything you need to know about phonium 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 um before we head right in for what we got for today please do what to like and subscribe to this my channel because i'll be posting updates more frequently than not so you won't miss out on anyone now phonium is one of the new age mobile only cryptocurrency that can be mined only on your mobile phone oh i don't know if you got that it's a mine app whereby you can mine cryptocurrencies that's what i was trying to say yes it's a building of community of users who would socialize the phonium coin yeah phd it's 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 its abbreviation you yeah, okay so the phonium ecosystem has the app which can be used to mine the phd coin then several mobile games that keep users engaged and incentive to the end and the more coins so now how big is phonium well the total of 2 billion phd coins or should i say phonium coins of this in a given 24 hour period but only about a million coins are traded indicating the liquidity is low and so how do you mine phd coin please note um i spotted that the liquidity is low already so how do you mine mining is one of the easiest thing to mine this thing just simply download the app once you download the app you sign into the app using your google account and uh, after you use your, your google account the interface comes up and you see start mining click on start mining and leave it up it starts mining automatically for you but at the end of seven days exactly seven days it is going to stop mining then you have to come back online and click start mining again unlike others that you have to click it every day so that's how it works so is PHD worth mining? Well, maybe, maybe is the answer because it is not the best or the most lucrative one out there. But it ha if you have a lot of patience, then you can go ahead and mining this. Why do I say so? Um, because the rate at which you mine PHD is extremely low. And now you may be like, okay, there are provisions for and speeding up the mining speed and so you may want to you may want to double up your speed by doing that of which i would advise you not to why two reasons firstly the rate at which you're doubling your mining is is way too like it's not worth it because um you the rate at which the phc mine is far lower than the deposit you're going to pay for doubling the currency the liquidity is low like i said now another thing you need to know about this phd is that thirty thousand phd is equal to one point something dollar now you can just imagine that and the record i saw a comment up here that says he has been mining for three months already and what he got on his wallet is four thousand phd that 4000 PHD is just some $0.5. I mean, you can see how slow this is. So, what about withdrawing from this platform? You end the PHD by the app, and the games can be withdrawn. And to withdraw from this platform to your Phonium wallet, you have to meet the minimum requirement of 30,000 PHD. Now, if you think about this now, if the guy that I saw his comment earlier said he has been mining for three months, I can just have. Um, 0, 4, 000, that is 0 0.5 that means roughly we should be mining up to a year before we could get up to this target and this 30,000 is just worth one dollar so is it what it I don't know it depends on your perspective how you view it or what makes you want to continue with P with phonix PhD but for me it's I would say it's for those who are patient and then you can just give it a try you pay nothing you have nothing to lose and i would advise you to subscribe for doubling your speed or anything of that nature no please avoid that avoid wasting your money okay and that is that for that thanks for seeing this review this is kaimo legit presenting to you and we would like to see you in the next video so do well to subscribe so you won't miss out on our next update it will be very important and so until then see you